who do we got over here? Master Kung Fu Shang Chi. Ready to fight coronavirus. Yeah. Yeah. Incredible figure. I don't feel like I'm holding a Marvel Legends figure. I feel like I'm holding more of a, I don't know, miscellaneous uh, martial arts, kung fu, karate figures. Uh, yeah. Let me start off by saying the flexibility or articulation on this figure is top notch, which it should be for a kung fu master such as Shang Shi. As you notice here, the torso super articulated so you could get all types of poses you could get all the cool poster looking poses you could uh make it all the way to the back here amazing articulation he kind of looks deformed but what does a uh, master of kung fu have in his skill set great ab articulation A face scan, very nicely done. A lot of articulation on the head scan as well. So he literally moves everywhere. Headband piece pretty much floating in the air. Kind of reminds me of a uh, Ricky Dragon Steamboat. One of the goats back in the days. The belt piece rubber you could pretty much fluctuate it around good articulation on the legs he cannot do a, a split legs don't go all the way to the back because of the pelvis piece double jointed legs double jointed arms hands It looks broken now. It'd be cool wearing like a little sling piece. Got some type of details here. The bottom of pants. The feet very articulated. <laughs> Look how that looks. That's hilarious. That's the that's the sun the rising of the sun finishing maneuver. That's hilarious. Great articulation, as you saw. Only trickery here is like standing him up in a good position, which has a, uh, oh well, not too bad. It was a mission at first, had to get the joints all flexible. He comes with two accessories, really cool accessories. I'm gonna see if I zoom in right here for a second. I'm trying to get the details for you guys. Let me see. Because the details on this should be uh, should be detailed on the camera. Let me see if I put them aside. It's kind of hard. I'm really trying to show you guys the details because Hasbro really went all out. Oh man, I don't know why it's, it's so bad looking. Let me see if the other one comes. This is the other one he comes with. Pretty much the same thing, just at a certain angle because they are not posable. They're not rubbery. Let me see if I detail it like this. So, I don't know if you can tell right there. Well, for some reason, details are eluding me right now. I don't know why it doesn't want to work with me, but it's pretty much a dragon uh, design. 
which is really, really cool. So it's a very detailed dragon designs on both ends. kind of see it right there there we go finally so very very detailed dragon design really really cool so it brings those two accessories right there it also brings the most extended um pair of hands i've ever seen so i guess hasbro blew the budget on shanghai i mean Shangxi, um because they didn't add no extra hands for the two spider-mans and the superior octopus so they blew all the budget on hands on Shangxi, which would make sense you know he has a lot of poses because he is the master of uh kung fu but there you have it folks, a great illustration of Shang-Chi. And I hope this persuaded you guys to pick him up because he is a great figure. Um, especially made for when the movie comes out, hopefully soon, sometime around. Oh, and another big factor. This figure actually has painted on nipples. Yes, folks, that is right. He got the Nip Man here. So he's not only the master of Kung Fu, he's the Nip Man. And as you stare into the nipples of future, hopefully uh, you 90s babies will get that reference. I am signing out saying goodbye. Fair go round is out.